started collecting in the 60s when we got married, and we were around when minimal conceptual art was first being introduced. Mr. Bowler, what attracted you to this minimalist abstract art? Well, it was fascinating at the time it was done because it was so new, and uh, I didn't know how it was going to turn out, uh, and it's a surprise to me the way it has. Yeah. Other collectors weren't interested in it, but we knew the artists who were doing this type of work. Because I was an artist myself, I feel very, very comfortable and wonderful with artists. And I think knowing the artists is certainly as important, and maybe in some cases more important, than the works itself. The only rules we had were they had to be affordable, and we had to be able to fit it in our apartment. But other than that, we had no restrictions of what we bought. 